ಬಂದೇಹಂ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರು ಶ್ರೀಯುತ ಪದ ಕಮಲ ಇಟ್ ಡಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾಟರ್ ವೆದರ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ರೀಚ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಆರ್ ಪೋರ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಎವ್ರಿ ವನ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ ಗೋ ದಿ ತ್ರೀ ಫೋಲ್ಡ್ ಮಿಸರೇಬಲ್ ಕಂಡೀಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಲೈಫ್ when typhoid is there it does not discriminate that here is a rich body i shall give him less pain no when the typhoid is there either your body is rich body or poor body you have to suffer the same pain when you are in within the womb of your mother you have to suffer the same pain either you become in the queen's womb or in the cobbler's wife that fact up situation they they do not know janma mrityu jar there are so many suffering in the process of birth there are so many sufferings in the process of birth and death and old age a rich man or poor man when we are old we have to suffer so many in validity similarly janma mrityu jara vyadhi jara jara and bed and mrityu so we are not conscious about the suffering position of this material body shastra says don't accept again any material body na sadhu manne this is not good that you are repeatedly getting this material body na sadhu manne jato atmano atmano the soul is encased in this material body jato atmanaya asannapi all the temporary are without this body please ado asadhi ho so if we want to stop this miserable condition of getting another material body then we must know what is karma what is bikarma that is krishna's purpose karma no bi bodhabham bodhabham to bikarma na akarma nashta bodhabham akarma na means there is no reaction reaction karma if you do nice work it has got reaction it is nice body nice education nice family nice riches this is also nice we take it as nice we want to go to the heavenly planet but we do not know that even in the heavenly planet there is the janma mrityu jara vyadhi that for krishna does not recommend that you go to the heavenly body he says ಆಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಭುವನ ಲೋಕ ಪುನರಾವರ್ತಿ ಅರ್ಜುನ ಇವನ್ ಇಫ್ ವಿ ಗೋ ಟು ದಿ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಲೋಕ ಸ್ಟಿಲ್ ದ ರಿಪಿಟೇಷನ್ ಆಫ್ ಬರ್ತ್ ಹ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಜದ್ಗತ್ಯಾನ ನಿವರ್ತಂತೆ ತದ್ ಧಾಮ ಪರಮಂ ಜದ್ಗತ್ಯಾನ ನಿವರ್ತನ್ ಬಟ್ ಯು ಡು ನಾಟ್ ನೋ ದಟ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ಧಾಮ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಸಮಾರ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಪ್ರಮೋಟ್ ಅವರ್ ಸೆಲ್ ಟು ದಟ್ ಧಾಮ ದೆನ್ ನ ನಿವರ್ತಂತೆ ಜದ್ಗತ್ಯಾನ ನಿವರ್ತಂತೆ ತದ್ ಧಾಮ ಪರಮ ಮಮ ಇನ್ ಅನದರ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ತತ್ತಿ ಹಂಗ್ ಪುನರ್ಜನ್ಮ ನೈತಿ ಮಾಮೆತಿ ಸೊ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಆರ್ ನೋ ಇನ್ಫಾರ್ಮೇಶನ್ ದಟ್ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಅದ್ ಸುಪ್ರೀಂ ಲಾರ್ಡ್ ಹಿ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ಗಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಪ್ಲೇಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಎನಿ ಒನ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗೋ ಹೌ ಒನ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಗೋ ಜಾತಿ ದೇವ ಭೃತ ದೇವಾನ್ ಪಿತೃನ್ ಜಾತಿ ಪಿತೃಭೃತ ಭೂತೇಜ ಜಾತಿ ಭೂತಾನಿ ಮದ್ ಜಾತಿ ನೋಪಿ ಜಾತಿ ಮಾ if one becomes devoted to my worship my business bhakti yoga he comes to me. in another place he says bhaktam am abhijanati java anjasta this is for our only business is to understand krishna jagya the karma this is akarma here it is said akarma na api bodhabhyam akarma nascha bodhabhyam akarma means without reaction yet if we act for our sense gratification the reaction is just like a soldier is killing is getting gold medal the same soldier when comes out home if he kills one man his hand why he can say in the court sir when i was fighting in the battlefield i killed so many i got gold medal and why you are hanging me just now because you have done for your own sense gratification and that you did for government sense therefore any karma if you do it 
for Krishna's satisfaction, that is akarmana. It has no reaction. But if you do anything for your own sense sanctification, you will have to suffer the resultant action, good or bad. Therefore Krishna says, karmana api bodhabhaṁ bodhabhaṁ ca vikarmana akarmanascha bodhabhaṁ gahala karmana adhati. It is very difficult to understand what kind of action you should do. Therefore we have to take direction from Krishna, from this hastra, from Guru, then our life will be successful. Thank you very much.